everybody happy first of december Woo! so please ignore my appearance i've literally just got out of bed um my skin hates me at the moment i genuinely look the same color as my wall so yeah today is the first of december which means vlogmas start i'm really excited to do vlogmas so yeah vlogmas starts today which i'm really excited about i've always wanted to do vlogmas since i started my youtube channel um i'm gonna do it weekly because i still work obviously i work from home a lot um and i've also got quite a lot of annual leave from work in december so i should have enough days to fill up enough content to make four weekly vlogs throughout december um so i hope you enjoy it has just been my sister's 18th birthday so that's why there's a random 18 hanging on the wall but i thought since it's the first of december the first thing we should do is open my advent calendar i went for a lint one this year this was only five pound which i think is quite a good deal for one of the like chunkier ones it's a little reindeer i don't know about anyone else but i always feel the need to say that to a point in the day where i'm actually going to need this like at nine o'clock in the morning i don't feel like i could eat a lint chocolate reindeer Another year has gone past where I haven't got a beauty advent calendar, which really upsets me. I would love to have a beauty advent calendar, but I genuinely think all the brands that release them, release them too late in the year. Like, I've spent all my money on Christmas presents. I can't afford to spend like £70 on a beauty advent calendar in November. But yeah, anyway, I'm not going to sit here waffling. I'm just going to film any little random bits of my day that are Christmassy. Some bits might not be Christmassy, I'm not gonna lie. Um but yeah I really hope you enjoy it. Uh yeah. First of December also means that you can have your breakfast in a Christmas bowl. This morning I'm gonna have porridge because we've run out of me a bit meat a bix. <laughs> we've run out of wheat a bix minis. So second best is porridge. evening everyone so it's a little bit later and I've just got the most exciting parcel ever ignore this pampas grass here it's drying it has to dry upside down for three weeks for some reason um so that's what that is so I ordered some of these led strip lights of amazon and they've turned up today and I want to put them up like it's in black and white so as you would have just seen from that time lapse and that slightly weird segment of video i have actually just put up my led lights in my room and they do look really really cool um i have no idea how the remote works i've somehow managed to get them to like this blue um i turned the light on because i do not think i could film especially in the dark with these lights on because they honestly make the room the weirdest colours um but yeah I think I'm gonna have a bath I really feel like having a bath um so yeah I feel like this first week of vlogmas is gonna be weird because it's only the first of December so there's not much Christmassy things I can do so yeah you'll have to bear with hopefully I can make it as festive as possible but yeah it's obviously not gonna be Christmas filled sadly oh I did put up my 
little room Christmas tree the other day um, which I filmed so I will insert that footage here so you can see me really trying hard to decorate it and make it look nice um, doesn't look great to be honest <laughs> December today only 21 sleeps till Christmas so I've been at work all of today which is why I obviously haven't been able to film anything but I'm actually on annual leave now and don't go back to work till Tuesday which I am looking forward to a nice little four day weekend um going to Lakeside tomorrow to do some Christmas shopping which I am so looking forward to like I haven't been to Lakeside in so long it's my favourite shopping centre I'm hoping it makes me feel a bit more Christmassy and that there's loads of Christmassy things to show you so I'll take you along to Lakeside so that'll be fun again sorry about this lighting it's just it's not good is it I've actually requested a return because I don't think they're right when I press the red button on the remote control that it came with they just go blue so I think they're not right somehow so I've ordered some from a different company um so yeah hopefully I can make them like pink because all the lighting that I can like all the options I can make these ones that I've got currently is just so bright and I'm pretty sure I've had a nightmare or like really weird dreams the past two nights and I'm pretty sure it's because of these lights really upset that Mo Farah got voted out of Amma Celeb last night um I was rooting for him to win he is so funny he's one of those people that you watch on the tv and you know they're like amazing but you never really get to know their personality because they're just on the tv for being like a sportsman but when you actually get to know his personality he is honestly I just want to like squeeze him he's so cute um he's so funny I found him on TikTok today actually which I'm very happy about so I will still get my nice daily dose of Mo Sarah. Who? <laughs> you know what it's because my boyfriend supports Liverpool so I'm so used to saying Mo Salah. So Mo Farah Mo Salah it's, it's confusing in the brain. What the heck? It's snowing. <laughs> everybody happy friday it's the 4th of december today and we have woken up to snow it stops so snowing now it's like set on the ground um love the snow but it has ruined my plans can't go to lakeside because the roads are just too messy and i've got to go on the motorway and that's not really what i want to be doing when it's been snowing so i'm just going to go into cambridge instead there's only 20 minutes up the road so a bit safer so yeah sad i can't go to lakeside i'll probably go there next weekend instead but we're going to cambridge it's snowing it's christmas <laughs> hello i'm back from cambridge um been a horrible rainy day the day started snowy 
ended rainy so that is why my hair looks an absolute mess um but i thought i'd show you what i got because i picked up a few little bits that weren't christmas presents obviously i'm not going to show you christmas presents because that would kind of ruin the surprise <laughs> so starting with primark primark actually have the most amazing um like paper packs or gift wrap packs so i picked up this one it's got these really cute little Christmassy designs for the wrapping paper. So you get four rolls. You get eight of the little bows. And you also get some gift tags that match. Um, and yeah, I just thought these were really nice. I really like the stripey one. I really like this little candy cane one. Yeah, and for £4, that's quite a good deal. Each wrap is two metres as well. So it's not like it's a really short um, roll. Also picked up some cotton pads because they're so cheap in Primark. They're only 50p for a massive pack like this. So I always get mine from Primark. And I also got some makeup wipes. These are the vitamin C facial cleansing wipes. So I just thought these look quite nice. And they're only a pound for a pack of two. So there's this new shop in Cambridge. It's called Love Min Miniso. Love Miniso. It's like a um, Japanese inspired shop kind of like a gift shop it gave me like tiger vibes like it had that sort of style and um, so we popped in there it's really really nice i don't know if this is just a cambridge thing or if there's i assume they have them in other cities um but yeah it's a really really nice little shop really good for gifts it's also really cheap um i picked up some little tea lights these are in the scent myrtle and cassis they smell amazing they're like sort of like raspberry it's really really nice these were two pound and then i also got this really really cute mug um i watch emily philpott's vlogs a lot and she always drinks out of a glass mug um and it looks really really satisfying and nice so when i saw this i had to get it um especially as it's christmasy so i think this was like how much was this This was only £3 and it's this little glass mug and I don't know if you can really see but it's got a little gold Christmas tree on and some little like sequiny bits. It's, it's really cute, I really really like it, I kind of wish I got another one. So yeah, I'm excited to have a coffee in this, I'm sure it will feature in these vlogmases a lot. <laughs> And then the last thing is actually really random. I found these in Boots and the only other place I found them is Holland and Barrett. Um, and they are the Libya's Million Squares. They're actually vegan, gluten and dairy free, um, which is really good, obviously. Um, yeah, it's just good. <laughs> I don't follow a vegan diet or anything, um, but these are amazing. They're kind of made up of like dates and stuff and I'm not normally one for a vegan sweet or chocolate like it just doesn't compare to normal but these are amazing and i would repurchase these every single day and um, they're a bit more expensive um than like your average chocolate bar but they are so worth it they're amazing um so if you're vegan and looking for like an orangey chocolate alternative this is so good they're like little millionaire um bites they're delicious yeah and the rest of the stuff i picked up is christmas presents so i can't show you no oh, i'll focus hello so yeah the rest of the stuff i picked up was christmas presents so i can't show you anything else i'm afraid but yeah i think me and ben are gonna go to nando's tonight um so yeah looking forward to that haven't been to a restaurant since coming out of lockdown so and Nando's is very much needed. Um, I definitely need to sort my hair out. My makeup stayed on okay despite having a mask on all day. Still not really enjoying that, but make sure you wear a mask. Protect everyone else around you. Um, what am I waffling on about? <laughs> oh, my new LED lights turned up today as well, um, which I've tested and work. So I'm gonna try and put them up maybe tomorrow. I probably won't have time tonight. Um, but yeah, that's all I have to update you on. Good evening, everybody. So, my room's looking quite purple, I know. Um, I put my new LED lights up, and they're so much better. Um, I feel like this lighting is actually acceptable and isn't giving me a raging headache, so that's all good. Today's actually Saturday, meaning this is going to be the last part um, of this weekly vlog. I'm gonna start vlogging again tomorrow 
ready for the next week. I went to TK Maxx today and literally picked up two really cute like Christmas gift wrap things which I want to show you. Firstly, I picked up this tissue paper and I just instantly fell in love with it. It's by a company called The Art File and this was $1.99 and it's basically like sheets of tissue paper but they just have the cutest like most homely heartwarming little designs on like how cozy is that it's just like i love like christmasy vibes like this i think they're so cute and then the other thing i picked up was just this little christmas bag like this little christmas gift bag and i thought it was so lovely so it's just blue and it has these little like gold speckly hearts on and then a little pink tag that says merry christmas i just really thought that was sweet how much was this £2.49 for this oh it's cute i also picked up this vase you probably can't see because it's quite dark in here but it's like this mauvey purpley like frosted glass and i've just popped my pampas grass in it and i love how it looks I've been hanging this pampas grass out to dry for like three weeks. So I think it's now fully dried. I hairsprayed it. I think that's meant to help it last a bit longer um, and popped it in there. And I really like how it looks. I think in this corner of the room with like the mirror, it looks really nice. And yeah, I'm happy with it. So I think that is going to end this first week of Vlogmas. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, like I've said a few times in the vlog, sorry that it's not been majorly Christmassy, but... Obviously, it's still only the first week of December, so I'm going to be picking up the Christmas tree next week. And obviously, as we get closer to Christmas, the more festive, fun things I will do that I can include. So stick with me. So yeah, like I said, I really hope you enjoyed this first episode of Vlogmas. Uh, make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed it, and I will see you next week. Bye.